Why am I getting nervous? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it has been an a crazy amount of time since I've seen you guys and have posted a video. This look has been my obsession over the past couple months and these are probably like my most favorite three shadows I've purchased from MAC like ever and the ones that I've used the most. Look at my babies. Oh, they're so cute. There's two of them there. They look exactly alike. I think that one, that one is in this lady. Their heads are turned so you can't really see their face. That's lady and that's prince with like his hand over his face. They're just so cute. Oh, I apologize if you guys hear like this loud noise in the background for like the first half of the video. It's my AC was on and it's really hot in here. <laughs> and so I had to turn it off because it was really loud. If you want to see how to get this kind of Kylie Jenner inspired everyday look, then go ahead and keep on watching. Okay you guys, so I already did my face, I already um, applied foundation, concealer, and um, I did my eyebrows as well as one eye. Um, so this is very neutral. This is what it's going to look like until you apply the liner. So let's go ahead and get started. First we're going to apply um, Makeup Forever's Aqua Cream in number 13, which looks like this. It's a very um, light champagne pink color. So go ahead and apply this on the lid. You kind of want to make sure you just um, place it on the lid instead of all over the eye. Um, because whatever shadow you're going to be applying will kind of turn um, like a sheen color, even if it's matte, just because of the base. So be really careful. I mean, if you don't care, I don't care. <laughs> Next, we're going to be going in with Max All That Glitters. Just go ahead and dab this all over the lid. Having the aqua cream underneath really emphasizes this color and makes it really pop. Next, we're going to go in with Texture, which is this really warm um, brown color. Place it in the outer corner first, and then move your way towards the inner part of the crease. Next, we're going to go in with Brown Script, which is a darker, more red-brown compared to Texture. And just Place this in the crease. First in the outer part and then work towards the crease. You want to make sure this stays in that crease. Um, so we're going to go in with Foxy and Walk of Shame from the Naked Basics palette. Go back in with your fluffy brush and just marry the colors together. Just like that. Easy. This is like heaven in a brush. I love using this brush because it gives me that nice crisp clean line without working too hard for it. As you can see in the video, I just do one swipe and it's nice and straight. Um, just maneuver the brush however you feel like is comfortable for you and just keep practicing. If it's hard for you, that's all I have to say is just keep practicing. Okay, so you guys can totally leave the eyes like this. I like my bottom lash smoked out, so that's what we're going to do. First, I like to... Um, apply my highlight under my eyes before I smoke out my bottom lash line. So I'm going to go in with Emphasize, which is almost gone. And I just start on the in inner corner and just swipe out. Um, I already applied my concealer and all that good stuff. This kind of just adds um, extra highlight. Then we're going to go in with texture and a little smudger brush like this and apply it lash on the lash line. This you can bring all the way in. 
Don't be scared. And I like to go in with a flat little brush like this. I'm going to go in with Crave from the Naked Basics palette. I just tap it on the tip of the bristles and just place it on the outer part of my lower lash line. Kind of just wiggle it there. Like that. Now for the rest of the face. Um, so the eyes are done. Everything's coolio. Good to go. Next, we're going to go in with contour. Because you see how round this face is. So we're going to go in with NYX um, Matte Bronzer and Medium. And Real Techniques um, Expert Face Brush. And just contour out these bad boys. Blend it out with some Hoola Bronzer from Benefit. Chin area. Had that double chin. A little more. <laughs> Oh my goodness. And then whatever's left over, I just hit my nose with it. Um, just to add some warmth. And not just to contour it, but to add some dimension. Next, we're going to go in with blush, which is just my all-time favorite warm soul by um, MAC. The back of the cheeks and move forward. Back of the cheeks and work forward. For the highlight, I am using um, Toki Doki's little eyeshadow thing in Carnivora with a little stippling brush from Real Techniques. And in the pictures you guys seen in the beginning of the video, I do have a different lip combo on. I will put that down below. I'm just currently out of them. I feel like this looks the same. Um, they're both very inexpensive lip products and one of them is by Wet n Wild and it's um, Bear It All, they're matte lipsticks and the other one is NYX um, Lip Liner in Natural which is the same lip liner I used in the other one just that lip liner is the retractable one um, it's in Natural, I don't know if it's the same color, I feel like this one's a little bit darker um, I'm not sure, but both the same products just in a different form that makes sense I like to apply the lipstick first um, just get on your lips, like so, they don't have to be super perfect, because we're going to go over it with the lip liner. We're going to go ahead with the whole Kylie Jenner-ish vibe and outline our lips a little bit. And just go ahead and fill in the rest of your lips. Thanks so much for watching. And if you guys have any requests, please leave them down below. Um, and thumbs up if this is helpful. Hopefully it is. And um, I'll see you guys in my next video.